still, you probably noticed that I look a little bit different today. Well, this avatar is one that I made with the uh, Taffy Avatar Creator, and that is a company that is making a um, avatar creator, and they're partnered with VRChat. Right now, it's in an open beta, and anyone can sign up. Just go to the website, put in your email address, and then it'll let you sign up and uh, try the avatar creator. And it works really well. So th one of the biggest issues with new players starting VRChat is that they don't really know how to make their own personal avatars. Um, the idea of using Blender and Unity and custom making your own avatar is quite overwhelming for a lot of people. So what this does is it makes it so you can have just a typical character creator so you can make your own custom avatar. And what's really cool is it's just super easy to use. All you do is you just go to the website, put in your email address, you download the program, and then when you get the program on your desktop, it's just like a basic character creator. From there, you just make your avatar, log into your VRChat.com account, and just press upload. And right there from the program, it uploads to your VRChat account, and you've got a custom avatar. It's so much easier than the other method, and it um, allows for a lot easier customization for a wider range of people. As well, it also solves that uh, issue a lot of people say with having so much anime, which I don't mind, but yeah, it's it's, it's pretty cool. It uh, opens up a whole lot of new opportunities for, for people. Something else that's really cool is these avatars are Quest compatible as well. So if you have these avatars, it'll show on PC and it'll show on Quest. So that's another really good upside to these. <laughs> so some things to take note of is right now the program is in beta, so it is uh, subject to change. Um, it's constantly being updated, but um, right now there's not very many options. Um, it's enough to get sort of a look that you like. Um, eventually there will be probably sliders and some height adjustments. When it does go live, it'll have the uh, basic options, I believe, and then more premium options that you'll have to pay for. Right now in the beta, there are some premium options, but they're free for now, so if you make an avatar before it goes live, you'll get to keep those, so that's pretty cool. But yeah, something definitely worth uh, checking out. Um, I'll leave links in the description, so just remember, it is still in development, it's in beta, in testing, Eventually it'll be released and be much more polished with more options. It's pretty cool though The uh, company is focusing on making this uh, these programs so you can make like characters and avatars for games and they partnered with VRChat so it's streamlined it's all works officially and uh, Yeah, it makes it super easy to just make a quick avatar and uh, Hopefully more people will start maybe using these and um, it'll make it better for quest users as well. There won't be so many avatars that are just replaced with the robots. If more people use these or quest compatible avatars, it'll just make the game better for everyone. So 